Hey everyone, so um, this video is going to be an update on this hair that I've been wearing. Um, which I guess comes at a good time because a lot of you have been uh, messaging me and asking me about this hair. So, um, yeah, and I talk about, if you haven't seen the first video about this hair, I talk about this hair in another video that I did, the hair talk video. Well, the other hair talk video. So if you're interested in that, I'll post the link right here or I'll post it also down below in the um, information area and you can check that out. But um, anyways, yeah, I guess I'm just going to update you guys on what's been going on with this hair. This hair is by Indian Remy and it's from their Janet collection. And it's the Deep Ripple hair. So um, as you can tell, it looks different from what it has in other videos. It's straight. Um, my sweet dear little sister <laughs> spent um, about an hour last night um, flat ironing it flat ironing it out for me so it is um straight and this is actually what it was like whenever I first got out the pack um I don't know if I showed you guys that but the hair was straight um I did show you guys that in the other video the hair was actually straight whenever it's um in the packaging it's straight but once you wet it or do whatever with it or you know if it gets manipulated in any type of way it does start to curl up and everything so um that is what happened to it so every time you've seen me you've always seen it like curled or something um, so it hasn't been straight since the day I actually put it in so she took her time and she pressed it out for me last night which I was so grateful for and in order to make sure that it stayed straight um, I wrapped it last night which I don't think I've ever wrapped any of my sew-ins before my weave period I don't think I've ever wrapped it before but it was really simple to do and I just wrapped it up and tied it up with my scarf and everything and came out nice and straight I didn't bump it or anything like that on the ends I just left it like this and this is um 12 inches I can't even stand up so that is 12 inches so alright to get into the update on this hair, um, I can say it's it's okay. Um, it hasn't been bothering me like too much, but um, if I could compare it to the goddess hair that I had in before, um, the goddess hair is still kind of winning even though it did start to shed a lot. Um, I had somebody tell me that this hair, they had a really bad experience with this hair shedding a lot. I can say that this hair doesn't shed a lot, but it does tangle a lot. And so whenever I'm combing it out, then, you know, of course, combing out tangles, then it starts to pull the hair out and then it begins to shed. So I get shedding from that, from the tangles. Um, so that's really like a downside of this hair it does tangle really really easily and that kind of bothers me but um and it's mainly like right here in this back area you know and I guess well most weave does do that you know whenever you're like laying you know sitting in the car and you have your back against the seat or you know sitting on the couch or whatever the case may be um it just tangles naturally more in the back but I just feel like this hair tangles like a lot more than the other hair that I had in um, but yeah the shedding's not too bad on it except for when it tangles and then it does shed whenever I'm combing out the tangles which I don't like um, besides that the texture of the hair I'm really loving the texture of it because it just looks so natural and it really does look like it's my own hair so I can say I really love that about it and my my real hair blends really easily with it so it doesn't look like you know I don't have this like really glossy really straight hair and then have like my hair that's been like pressed out to try to make it blend like this hair is it's not too glossy but it's not really dull either um so it looks really good together you can't really tell where my hair ends and this hair begins so I do like that um, what else can I say about this hair? I don't like the fact that the ends 
are very raggedy <laughs> on this hair and I will use the word raggedy they're they're raggedy I don't like that and I'm gonna have to clip off not so much in the front but in the back you see that they're really raggedy and I just feel like I would hate to have paid for you know this length of hair and then have to like chop a certain length off of it just to get it because I mean even though it does look natural it looks like I have like bad ends on my hair and nobody wants to look like you have like crappy ends like split ends and bushy ends and stuff that's not cool so even with flat ironing it it's still the ends still look kind of eh. it's pretty easy to manage except for you know if there's any type of humidity or anything like that like I told you guys before it does have the texture of natural hair natural curly hair so um, whenever there is any type of humidity or moisture anything like that it does revert to a um, curly or wavy um, state or just gets frizzy or whatever you want to call it mainly not really frizzy but mainly it just starts to wave back up and everything and um, that's the only thing I kind of don't like about it either because I just much prefer for it to stay straight like with my goddess hair it was like a relaxed yakky hair so if it ever got any type of moisture or anything like that it would still stay um, straight no matter what unlike this hair but um, I don't really know if that's like a pro or a con because it blends with my hair because my hair does the same thing if there's any moisture or anything like that you know it starts to revert to this natural consistency and so it ends up all blending no matter what goes on as opposed to whenever I had the other hair in um, you know my hair would get all puffy and crazy looking and the hair would still, it would still be straight on the bottom so that would look really odd so I can't say no matter what happens with this hair it all blends and it all looks uniform and looks you know natural and goes together but um, yeah, I guess that's my little update on this hair, my experience with it. Um, I will have this in for like two more weeks until I get back home. Um, once I get back home, um, I don't know if I'm going to keep this hair in or um, buy some more goddess hair because I really, really like that hair. Or I might do some research and find out um, other good hair companies that might work out well like um I've always heard good things about Bobby Boss so I don't know might try that not really sure but um yeah I guess that's it if you guys have any questions or anything like that just leave them down below I'm trying to think if there's anything that I'm leaving out about this hair I don't know I don't I don't think I'm leaving anything out I think that's it um and I know a lot of you were requesting for a um to not requesting a video but a lot of you were asking me about the loose waves that I had in the other video um with like my Inglot and stuff like that um I will be doing a video on that very soon so look out for that and um yeah I don't think I'm forgetting anything so um if I if I am I'll probably just uh, do a blog post on it so well I will do a blog post on this anyways but um, if I did forget to say anything in this video if you check out my blog you'll definitely read it there and see it there so um, that's about it you guys I hope you all are having a wonderful day and I guess I'll see you all in my next video bye